happy vlogmas day two it's what time is it it's 8 45 and i just woke up i'm probably gonna go back to sleep for a little bit honestly because i'm really tired or i'll just like sit here and scroll on my phone for a bit which is what i usually do whenever i wake up Today's the day that the cats arrive, and I'm really excited for the kittens. I have a lot to do today for them though. I need to set up their like little room, their litter box. All of their toys actually never came in. I thought that I ordered toys, but they never came in. So maybe, did I ever order them? It says that they're arriving tomorrow. So I guess the kittens are going to be without toys for one day. Archie's about to run in. Ready? Archie! <gasps> Hi! Wow! He gets really excited whenever he comes home. Or whenever he- You happy? Well, okay. He just had breakfast. And he gets really excited whenever he comes inside from going potty in the morning. You excited for your kitties today? I don't think that I'm doing anything Christmas today because it's going to be a busy day just getting the kittens and like making sure that they're all settled in but we're not picking them up until four so have some time before that. Why are you crying? Come here. Come here. He loves to cuddle in the mornings. There's Reese. There's Reese. Whoa. Okay. First order of business today is cleaning because I'm actually allergic to cats. I'm allergic to my dogs. I'm allergic to pretty much anything with fur. But I recently just started allergy shots. And I also just started a new allergy medicine, which has been working like pretty well, honestly. I'm normally really stuffy and congested. And my eyes are always itchy whenever I wake up in the morning because my dogs sleep in bed with me. Um... And I have not been at all lately from this allergy medicine. I've been allergic to animals my whole life, but I've like slowly been becoming immune to my own dog just because I'm around them so often. So when I'm around other people's dogs, I have an allergic reaction. When I'm around my own dogs, it's not as bad just because I'm more used to them. So with the cat, I am very allergic to cats. So I'm curious how that's going to go with this new medicine, but I've been feeling like great with this new medicine. So I'm hopeful that I won't have a reaction, but I'm gonna clean anyway, get any like loose dust up, um, clean my sheets, get all the dog hair off my sheets, just so I can kind of have like a fresh clean slate with everything dust free and dog hair free. A few allergies are worth it for the happiness that animals bring me. So I'm not too worried about it. I've like dealt with allergies my entire life. Out of all of the animals, I'm most allergic to cats. So that's why I've never gotten a cat before. So it'll be interesting to see how this goes, but I'm only fostering them. So it's not like I'm keeping them permanently. So if it goes bad, they will be adopted anyway. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. <laughs> walk with my dogs before I need to like start doing all the cat stuff. These are reusable eye patches so you just stick them back in this little container after you clean them.
vitamin C from Summer Fridays. Let this dry before I put on my sunscreen. Because whenever I put on my sunscreen on too quickly, it starts all of my like skincare starts flaking off. For sunscreen, I've been using the Hero Force Shield, the green one. It kind of has like a green tint to it, so it helps with redness. My eye bags are so bad lately. I think it's because I've been using um eyelash serum. Eyelash serum, I found this out later, apparently like gets rid of the fat in your eyes and like underneath your eyes. So my eyes have just been so hollow lately <laughs> but i refuse to get filler under my eyes because it can migrate and also like a needle this close to my eye no thank you trying to pick out something to wear is the bane of my existence because i have so many things but i never know how to put it together like i thrifted this a couple days ago it's a uh is it pronounced uniqlo a uniqlo vest i'm pretty sure it's originally sold for like 70 bucks i got it for four dollars Maybe I'll just wear it with these pants, because these are like black pants. I have no idea what to wear. Maybe I'll just wear it with like a basic gray swa. Her neck. This is from Macalone, actually, the coffee brand. The sweatshirt's so big, though. Come here. Hello. You guys want to go downstairs? I'm coming. I'm coming. Why are you so happy today? Whoa. Do you guys wanna go for a walk? Are you happy? Do you want to go for a walk? Oh, okay. Okay, hold on. I just got back from my walk with the dogs. Now I'm gonna do my makeup and then set up the cat's room. Um, I'm gonna do the cat's room in the bathroom. So that's where they're gonna be for the first couple of days just to get adjusted to the house and to like the smell of the dogs. There are a few things that haven't come in yet, like the litter box mat, which is kind of disappointing because that's what picks up the litter off their paws when they step out of the box, but it's okay. And then also some toys. So I actually might head to the pet store in a bit just to pick up a couple toys so that they're not super bored and that in their room when they're sleeping there. I keep saying this, but I'm so excited for them. I'm just, I don't think I've ever held a kitten before now that I think about it. Like I've only ever pet cats before or adult cats, but never a kitten. So I'm excited to see them. Put you in this, bud. I think that this is the litter. Yeah. This. 
less mess clumping mini pellets. Oko cat. It says plant based litter. I don't know, I've heard reviews in there, but. This is where the cats are gonna stay in this bathroom right here it says that they should be staying in an enclosed space for at least like 48 hours after bringing them home so this is what we're gonna do for them because we also don't really want them to be on the carpet just yet in case they have an accident so we're gonna let them stay on the tile trash will obviously have to go up I did order a mat for under there, but it, it's not coming in until tomorrow. And then I ordered them a little scratch pad that I shoved in here. Scratch pad. Okay, I'm leaving right now to go pick up the kitties. We have to drive all the way to Alexandria to get them. The pet store in Alexandria. And then we have to drive back to Alexandria again, to, again tomorrow because they're getting dropped off at the adoption event. I think I have everything I need. I don't have any treats for them. And I I kind of want to stop by a pet store. I was going to go to a pet store and never ended up going. So I really want to get them some treats. Okay. I'll bring you guys along. I'm so excited. Breezy's acting like I'm leaving her forever. She always gets so sad. Bye, baby. I love you. You gotta be a good girl. <laughs> I have my camera's even full. Can I plug my phone in? Yeah. I'm gonna use mine, so. <laughs> oh. Hi! Oh my gosh! <laughs> okay, ready? One of them came out to eat, so the other one's coming out. Here you go. Oh my gosh. I think that this food is a hit. <laughs> they love it. Oops, take this out. with each other. <laughs> I'm gonna try and get the cats to use the litter box. I think that that's it for tonight. 
because they need to just decompress a little bit. So I'll see you guys tomorrow.